Hello everyone, so in this video, let us talk about a problem from lead code. The problem name is concatenation of array. So you are given that you are given an array as you can see nums uh, in the input and you want to create an array answer of double the length of nums that is 2n and what you want to see is that you want to first nums of i is equal to nums of i for all the first n characters and nums of i plus n is also nums of i which means that you are just concatenating the same array two times. So as you can see that in the input you have one to one. Now this is output 1 to 1, 1 to 1, which means that the same array is just concatenated two times, just added two times and you just have to print that new array, okay, just doubling out the same array, that's, it. that's the whole problem. Now how you can do that problem, first you have an array, let's say n, you have to first create one more new array of length 2n, okay, then what you do, you just iterate over this whole string, so for the first n characters, you will just put answer of i is equal to nums of i. So for the first character, you just copy it out directly. But for the next i plus n characters, you will again copy them out. But pretty much simple. So what you can do is I'll just give you a very small uh, example. What you can see is that the array is 2, 1, 3. So you will just make an array of length 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay. Now what you will do is that for the first three positions, you will directly put these. But for the next three again, you will put this. So what you can directly do is if this is the index is 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So what you can do is that when you are doing a for loop for this particular half till the first n characters, you can directly also add them in the next half as well. Okay, which is i plus n. Okay, so if this is i, i is point, then this is i plus n because you have n box to the next because n positions you will filling out using this for loop. Now i plus n, okay, is the again concatenation, the new array that you want to concatenate. That's it. Nothing much complicated here as well. So what we have done is that we have created a new array of size 2n. Then you just iterate over this whole array till from 0 till n. Now you have to just iterate in the or fill in the new array. That is this new array that you have made that is a. Okay. Now what you will do? You will just iterate over the first n characters. Okay. The first n numbers in the array nums. Now a of i is equal to nums of i which will be able to fill the first n characters and a of i plus n is equal to nums of i again. Okay, these are the just two, two expressions which I've used here as well. Okay, so this expression is used to fill the next n characters and this is used to fill the first n characters so that I will get two concatenations of the same array in the 2n array and that you just print out or return the total new array uh, which has the same concatenation of the same array double. Okay, that's it. That's the overall logic and the code part for this problem as well. It's a very simple problem. If you still have any doubts, you can mention on in the comment box of this particular video. I will see you in the next one taking coding and bye.